I'm back. Back to do Nico. Swagger game. Swagger game. That do Nico. Got my mixtape swag life that's getting ready to drop September 1st. Make sure y'all cop that. It's gonna be on Netflix and everything for the free download. But if you want like the exclusive CD, you need to come holla at me, man. For some people, I'm gonna give away free because I do got a lot of supporters and I appreciate everybody for holding me down from back when I was doing songs on MySpace and all that. Um, but I'm gonna be everywhere with it. The ocean front, high street in Portsmouth. Um, military circle, Jana, shopping center. We out Chesapeake, wherever it is out Chesapeake. Around Crestwood, everywhere. I need to come fuck with me, man. Back, leaving the battle and shit alone. If y'all ain't talking about battling Nico for the money, don't mention battle, because I'm not gonna go and tell you nothing. Point blank, period. Well, Swagger Gang Rebirth is gonna drop in November. I'm saying, Swagger Gang Rebirth is basically my group. Cause I know before when y'all heard me like back when Swagger Gang Volume Two was out, and I had different members. You know what I'm saying, but now it was a lot of disloyal members. They had to, you know what I'm saying, it's business. So they got the boot. Now I got other people. You know what I mean, shouts to Drado. I mean, that boy Kenny P. Duty. Shouts to Nino. My nigga convertible cap. Like y'all gonna have a lot of new like people that really got bars, man. It ain't, it ain't just Nico. Y'all hear Swagger Gang and y'all just think of Nico. Like it's way more than that, man. Moves is being just grinding. Oh yeah, I'm on Hot 91 too. Shouts to my boy DJ Jump Off, the whole Jumpstart ENT. I got that intro for Jump Off. Tune into that every Saturday. Hot 91, 3 o'clock p.m. Y'all should turn to it like maybe like 2 or something. Just so y'all can hear it. Yeah. Um, a lot of stuff is going on right now, man. I can't even complain. Shouts to Headhunters, though. Like, Mount. Man, you, you gave a lot of niggas a name out here. Like I tell you when I talk to you, a lot of people don't pay homage. But I'm going to do that. Like, I salute you, bro. Like, I thank you for all of them. VA, we coming. But let me not just say VA, because I guess everybody think I'm from Virginia, because I've been here. Long Island. I mean, 61. Boys here. Yeah, man, I'm here in VA, so I'm going to put VA on. Ain't nobody else doing it. Everybody rapping, but ain't nobody showing love. This shit is like a crab bucket, man. When a nigga get to the top and start trying to pull him down, like, do what he doing. I'm saying, or rock with him, don't hate on him, show a nigga love, man. We all can do it. We all can do it. Swag gang me. Look, somebody lied if they said I'm not a star. But if we got a problem, boy, the chopper in the car. I hate them girls. I mean, it's on some shit like people haven't heard me since. People haven't heard me on the beat since 2009. So I feel like people is going to underestimate me and I ain't want nobody to say this song wouldn't be hot because, or oh, the song is only hot because such and such was on. I don't want that, so I, don't, I kill everything. Dolo. I even did a song with some auto tunes and that's me singing and shit on that Marvin's one. Just so I don't want, I don't want no feature. Not that I don't fuck with nobody, I just wanted to do this one. But this is me, like this is all of me. Like the tracks that y'all hear is the same stuff I talk about on Facebook. I be tweeting on Twitter. You know what I mean, situations with my VM situations, my exes situations with people that I have personal problems with. Like everything is just me, 100% Nico. But after this, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm willing to collab with people. I'm not no, not no funny style nigga. You spit, you sing, whatever. Like we can make music. That's what I do. Okay, um, as far as, like I said, Swagger Gang, I heard you shout out Nino. Yeah. Um, nah, Nino, nah, he not Swagger Gang, though. He ain't Swagger Gang. But that's my little homie, though. You know what I'm saying? I, I fuck with Nino. Okay. You know, we, we, me and Nino, we, we about to get in the booth and do a couple joints, too. Like, a lot of stuff. Nino been working hard, too. I mean, he did that He did that battle against Beach Boy. Shouts to Beach Boy. And Nino did that joint. It was a favor for me. I mean, Mount Mount about to cry because Nino um, responded to him and all that. So I had to get Nino back in there. And we focused, man.
and how you feel about um as far as what what the internet saying the comments about um you versus King, how you feel about that battle? I mean that battle. I mean I feel like it could have it could have went you know what I'm saying another way. I mean I would have been it would have been better if we would have finished it you know what I'm saying. But due to the people in the crowd not you know what I'm saying being respectful of the battle. You can't really complain about that. I mean, it didn't, it didn't turn out as bad as I expected. You know what I'm saying? As far as the outcome on some, knowing that I don't really fuck with him and he don't really fuck with me. My niggas and his niggas ain't getting to it. No shots was fired or none of that. And that's really how I thought it was going to turn out. You know what I'm saying? But, I mean, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, I'm not giving him the first round. The battle was two rounds. I'm not giving him the first round. Niggas can say what they want to say, but if y'all, it depends on how y'all judge the battle. Like, if y'all go by crowd reaction, I don't go to battles deep. There's no need to, because I go there to, for bars. And if I bring a whole bunch of niggas, that means I'm not really trying to rap. Like, we come in there to beat somebody ass. I went there to spit. First round, I got it the fuck in. He got, he got his rocks off. I'm not no hater, he got his rocks off. He didn't win. Second round, I was distracted by, you know what I'm saying, little side comments. I mean, so I'm just like, fuck it, like, let's just get this shit over with. So he got his second round off, and I'll give him the second round. So for the battle to be completely decided, we needed that third round. I mean, but like I said, I'm not holding no grudges. I'm trying to make music. Niggas got kids out here that need to be taken care of. I mean, shouts to the boy. As far as uh, industry music, you heard that new Kanye and uh, Jay-Z? The Otis joint? Nah, I'm talking about the album. Nah, I ain't, I ain't, I'm, I'm not, I ain't gonna, I'm not even a fan of neither one of them. I fuck with Kanye to a certain extent, but I don't think I'm a cop. I heard, I have heard that they got some, some hot joints though. I heard they got some bangers. Though. I'm fucking with Meek Mill's heavy right now. That's what I'm rocking with right now. So you heard the Dream Chasers? Yes. Okay. Yes. I had to get my homegirl Bud to download that for me. Okay. I'm not a fan of Wale. Hmm. Not a fan of Wale. So you watch this, I'm not dissing, I'm just not a fan. I'm not Rick Ross. Fuck with Rick. Fuck with Rick. Fuck with Rick. Hmm. So with that being said, any closing statements you gotta say to any situation you need to address or speak on that people already don't know? As and mixtape. Speak what you know. Like I, don't, I feel certain certain type a certain type of way. Pardon me. I feel a certain type of way when I hear certain comments coming from people's mouth that don't know anything was going on. Like don't listen to this person, and this person wasn't around. Or if this person doesn't fuck with me, it's rare that you're gonna hear him say that Nico did this, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna hear whatever the opposite is because that's, niggas lie. Like niggas worse than these bitches out here. Like niggas is lying. Niggas is lying, dog. And I just, be yourself. Like don't put on no front for these females. If they don't fuck with you, kick rocks with no sucks in the winter time. Just do what you do, man. But another closing statement, I don't, I don't have no beef with nobody. Swag Life is about to drop September 1st. Make sure y'all cop that. Swagger Gang Rebirth is coming out in November. It's just Swagger Gang. That's all it is, man. I'm looking at some jail time. Fuck my next court date. Nickname them Strawberry. They getting that shortcake. Sitting in the lap with some bitches in the back and they friend in the front seat. Licking on the sack. Blowing that loud and sipping on the yak. If it's beef in the streets, I'm dipping on the Mac. I'm grinding. Trying to put my city on the map. We can battle. If you niggas really want to rap, you whack. And I'm just giving you the fact that dude Nico was gripping every track. Oh.